Hello, my beautiful YouTube friends. I know Bobby, our dog, is is our introduction to our video. <laughs> I think he's gotten used to to YouTube, right, Bobby? Right, Bobby? Isn't he cute? He's so adorable. He's always tr trying to be with us when we're in in our kitchen. So, so what did you say, Mom? Oh, so right now we're gonna do some spaghetti. Now this type of spaghetti is, um, we're boiling some water as you can see here. This type of spaghetti is a vegetarian type of spaghetti that we learned to do while we were living in Costa Rica. So it's a Costa Rican type of spaghetti. We try to do it the way that we learned it back then. So for those people that are from Costa Rica, if we don't do it exactly the way that it's supposed to be, pardon us. We're just gonna do our best. So these are the ingredients. We're gonna use some cilantro, some tomatoes, some green pepper. So it's very simple. The water is boiling so we could put the um, spaghetti and I'll show you the next step. All right, guys, so as you know, the ingredients already from what I just stated. So my mom is cutting out the uh, vegetables, right, mom? And green uh, the green pepper. You already cut some red pepper, right? Yeah. Oh, so we need red pepper, tomato, and um, some cilantro right here. It smells really good. I love vegetables. So you're cutting them in a long form, right? Yeah. All right. This is horizontal. Yeah, vertical. Vertical, okay. So are you using a half of a green pepper? Uh, I'm going to use some more. You're gonna use some more? Okay. Uh -huh. So those are beautiful colors right there, red pepper and green pepper, right? Mm -hmm. So the water for the spaghetti is still not boiling. So we're waiting for that to ha um, happen. Oh, okay, so you're using, that's it? Mm-hmm. Okay, so you use like a one and a half green pepper, right? Okay, so my mommy is cutting some tomatoes. She says that for this dish, you use a lot of tomatoes, right? Yeah. But today I think we're gonna use three tomatoes. So three whole tomatoes is fine. But if you wanna use some more, it's even better for this type of dish. It's for this vegetarian spaghetti Costa Rican type of a, um, type of a dish. So mommy is putting all those vegetables inside that bowl and you're gonna keep on cutting more tomatoes. Okay my beautiful friends we're gonna use Barilla spaghetti. So this is the one that we make. Um, al dente is perfection in nine to ten minutes and this is true because I boil the spaghetti for nine minutes and it's just perfect. So um, if you don't know exactly when spaghetti is done, just put nine minutes. So I think the water, water is boiling. So you see my mom is about to cut the cilantro. She's already cut three big tomatoes, some green peppers, and the other red peppers. All right, mom, so you're gonna show us how to put that? Oh my, my mommy does it so way different than I do. Okay, so what I do is that I'll put the timer to nine minutes. And we started right there. And we put a little bit of salt. Don't use any olive oil. Don't waste your olive oil um, because it won't make any difference. Right, Mom? Mm -hmm. All right. No, it doesn't really. It doesn't make any difference. So you'll just be wasting good oil. So we'll wait that for, for the spaghetti to be uh, done at al dente in nine minutes. All right, guys. So my mom is just putting... Removing the water into a strainer, I believe it's called, and um, and she puts cold water immediately, right? Is there a reason why you put cold water immediately on top of the spaghetti? Cold, yeah, cold water. Yeah, is there a reason why, mom? Reason why? Uh huh. No, I don't want it to more cook. Oh, you don't want it to keep on cooking, right? Because it's already hot. All right. All right, so my mom is cutting some onions. We forgot to add as part of the ingredients, onions. So how much of onions are you gonna put on this? Almost one onion. Almost one onion. All right, so you cut it that way. My mom is cutting the, the, the vegetables the same method. 
right? All right, and adding that to our vegetable list right here. And we're gonna be using some butter, all right? Immediately. Okay. Immediately, okay. So let's look over here. And, oh, let's turn this on, Mom. Let's turn on the stove. And you put them in medium heat, right? Yeah. All right, perfect. And we're gonna be adding some butter. Some butter. Okay, so how much butter are we gonna be adding? Uh, like that. Like this? Okay. Maybe more. So it's a little bit more than a... So that's a big scoop right there. Okay, yeah, so we'll be adding that. So this is the way that we're gonna do our spaghetti with um, some butter. Okay, so you're waiting that for that to heat a little bit, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then I'm going to put my onions. Okay, so mom is gonna be putting her onions inside the pots. So that melts really quickly. Perfect. All right, so we're cutting some garlic right there. Um, that's um, half of, that's a, a one small clove, actually two small cloves. And as you can see right here, we have our onions melting on the butter. Right there. And um, my mom is going to be adding those two cloves of garlic. I asked her, why don't you just use the minced garlic instead of peeling those cloves? She says she prefers the, the cloves instead. So it's a matter of preference. So I'll be adding the cloves right there and keep on cooking those onions under the, uh, under the uh, butter. All right, guys. I know this is a vegetarian dish, but someone in the house wants to add a salmon burger to eat with us with sweet with the vegetarian dish so i'm just frying that um a salmon burger and um two breaded fish sticks all right so that's a pretty cool idea for those that don't want it completely vegetarian now i noticed that the one thing that is probably not vegetarian is the butter so if you want to use some um, oil olive oil instead um if you're really into vegetarian, completely vegetarian, just do that. So my mom is adding the spaghetti on top, right? Qué rico. My Más mom said, <laughs> What delicious. Delicious, right? Yeah. What delicious smell. Yeah, just the smell is delicious. And yeah. So really simple, just add the butter. A scoop of butter, then the onions, red onions. Oh, my mom says to tell you guys that in Costa Rica, they put the vegetables in a blender. But yeah. we're not going to do it this way. So they, they, they put it in a blender, right? Oh, oh. Primero era blendis. Esto era, esto era. Well, this is in English, mommy. <laughs> so mommy is cutting the uh, cilantro. So we'll add that. So remember guys, please add the vegetables first before you add the spaghetti. Very important. My mom is a little sad about that, that she added the spaghetti first. So I'm just frying that salmon burger right there and some two fish sticks. Um, you could buy this at Costco. We love salmon. And mommy, um, you're gonna add salt, right? Salt and black pepper. Let me pass pepper. the black pepper for you. Let me see here. The amount of salt all varies on your taste. Here you go. Some. This black is pepper. the black pepper that we're adding. Okay. So we like a little bit of a spice to it. That's why we add quite a few amounts of black pepper. It smells really good. You could smell all the vegetables. What else do you add, Mom? Oh, you mean the chicken stock. Uh -huh. But it all depends on how you want it. I don't really want like chicken stock on it. Mommy says if you want, you could add some chicken stock. Okay. So Mommy is adding the cilantro. Oh my, the, the, those, that smells really good. Mommy is adding the cilantro to it. Smells really, really good. It's almost done, right, Mom? No. Not really? Okay. Okay, Mom says that Daddy likes a little bit of spice 
to his vegetarian spaghetti. So we're going to put a little bit of cayenne pepper to give it a kick. I noticed that we put a lot of cayenne pepper in our foods, so that's enough. Okay, mommy is adding a little bit of ketchup to our delicious vegetarian spaghetti. Um, the reason why is probably because we didn't add too much tomatoes, right? Yeah. If we would have added more tomatoes. How many tomatoes do you think you normally add in this? Six. Six tomatoes, and we only added three. So this is the reason why. Look. Look. Uh -huh. Look the, the spaghetti is ready. It's ready, right? Isn't yeah. that awesome? And my salmon with the fish sticks are ready too. That's going to be accompanying our vegetarian spaghetti. Delicious. Spaghetti. Right, our spaghetti is done. Bobby, aren't you happy that our spaghetti is done, huh? I think he is. All right, guys, so it's done. Isn't that delicious? All those delicious vegetables. It would have been even better if you would have fried the vegetables first, right? Some people like to put meat. Yeah, but it then it wouldn't be a real vegetarian Costa Rican dish, would it? I'm going to put meat. I like, I'm going to add meat. One day, okay. One day. Then it wouldn't be Costa Rican, right? The Costa Rican style. Yeah. It would be your type of, of um, spaghetti vegetarian dish. Wow, looks nice. Awesome. All right, guys. So this is our finishing touch. Some vegetarian spaghetti my mom added some parmesan cheese but if you want it completely vegetarian don't add the cheese um, and we have the salmon burger with some fish sticks with our delicious spaghetti here at Florida kitchen so comment subscribe and share our delicious vegetarian Costa Rican spaghetti dish bye bye guys see you soon